Welcome to the show. This is your first one on one interview. We have a lot of ground to cover. So I have one request at the very beginning. Please try to be as specific as possible. Do I have your agreement on that? I will be as specific as I can be, okay? But um, if I want to explain a certain answer of mine in a slightly broader fashion, then I don't think that should be a problem with you. And if I want to draw you back? You can draw me back as many times as you want. Moving on to your first question. Are you open for the post of society chairman? I woke up this morning, okay, and uh, I had a cup of tea and I came here in the blue. You are car. avoiding my question. I want you to be very specific and answer. Are you open for the post of society chairman? See, there is a structured process, okay. If the members of this building choose, then I'm happy to be the chairman. I have reports here that say you didn't attend last year's AGM. Why didn't you? Do you know chairs with wheels? Okay, they go round and round. You know, like wee. I'll bring you back to my question. Why didn't you attend last year's AGM? Yeah, I'll get that. Okay, uh, I was sitting on one of those chairs at a kitty party. Okay, and I was whirling around and I stubbed my toe. You stubbed your toe. That's why you didn't attend last year's AGM. You do know you are an aspirant for society chairman. To understand why I missed the AGM through a stubbed toe. You have to understand who I am. Okay, I mean, look at this. Look at how delicate that is. We'll just move on. What do you plan on doing about the people who park in other spot? The sky is blue. Okay. Why is it blue? You're asking me the question. Yeah, I'm asking you a question. I'm gonna respectfully direct the question back to you. What are you gonna do about people who park in others' parking spot? See, I've been working on this problem for the past year or so with the security guard and there's a process okay a structured process and parking in other people's spots is it's just not me of course it's not there's another issue in this building the people of the building want to know what do you plan on doing with those people who don't pay their maintenance charges on time mm. <laughs> about that actually Hello, hello mommy. Ah, no, out of syllabus pooch rai. Any maintenance. Oh, 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 See, Santa Claus is coming to town. Okay. He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows when you've been bad or good. How does that solve the problem? See, I've said this before and I will say it again. Okay. I believe that whoever is responsible for not paying their maintenance should be punished, regardless of who they are. But the more fundamental issue here is that we need to empower the women in this society. We need to empower the youngsters. We need to. We'll get back to that. What do you think about our opponent? Yeah, we need to empower. I'm here for one thing, okay? We need to empower the young. But you're not answering my question. There is an opponent, okay? And fundamentally, I disagree with him. Okay, there's an ideological battle that's going on. But the main issue, and I don't know why nobody's asking this, is that we need to empower the youngsters. We need to empower the youngsters. No, I keep saying this. We need to empower the young what? Can you get a can as can as can a can? I'll 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 answer that question, okay. But the fundamental issue here is that we need to empower the